left a little after a month, I think. So it was in fe early February. Mm -hmm. Signed my first client for uh, as a retained recruiter for 6K. Yep, exactly. And then do you remember how fast right after that you got additional clients? Um, so that one renewed with me a little bit um, for another 4K. Yep. And then I got another one um, the following month, um, 11K, yep. about 11K. Yep. And then the following month, another one for about 10 and 10.5K, 11K, somewhere around there. Yep. So within our program, the 90-day program, you made your first 10K almost at 30 days. But within 90 days with me, you were already hitting that 30K and then growing from there, which is amazing. I mean, congratulations. You were like, you made me so proud because you showed up every week and did the work and it was amazing. Um, let me ask you, a lot of women probably one or two go, okay, so you're getting the clients, the money was coming in, you're learning the recruiting. How did you actually get the clients? Everyone can teach how you go after clients. And I know a lot of women struggle with confidence with that if they're doing it on their own. How did it help having a mentor teach you maybe what I knew or learned or that you learned to go after those clients because you weren't a recruiter yet? And I remember you being fearful. You've had that like um, imposter syndrome women get where you're not a recruiter yet, but you're going out your, and you're selling this retained deal. Can you talk about that a little bit to help women kind of know how that would work? Yeah, yeah, absolutely. At first, you're not going to know anything. <laughs> if you're just starting out, that is normal. You're not going to know anything. And that is absolutely fine. Um, when you have somebody like Diane behind you, I went to Diane, and I'm like, Diane, help. I don't know anything. I want to do this thing. I'm drowning. And Diane was like, don't worry, I got you. Let's start. And teaching me from A to Z what to do. So as with anything in the world, you don't know starting off. Um, you know, the world renowned surgeons, they didn't know what a scalpel was when they started, right? So that's how you start. You're not going to know anything. But if you go with an expert who has at least two decades, is it, Diane, yeah. of experience mm -hmm. of, um, you know, starting from the bottom and going up to executive recruiting, then you are starting, you're not starting from zero by yourself. You're starting with an expert with their knowledge, and they're going to teach you everything that they put in decades of trial and error to learn. So essentially I was starting from nothing by myself, but because I was with you, I had all your knowledge and your skills to, to take me through. So that's why I was able to, to scale so quickly. Yeah, no, I appreciate that. That's true. I think why start on your own and re reinvent the wheel when you can get the contract templates and the little lingo we see in the phone to make the clothes and and just the confidence of knowing you have an advisor there to tell you like when you're stressed out alone, you're not alone ever. So thanks for bringing that up. And even you mentioning healthcare is great because you came from a healthcare background. I mean, your background was not recruiting, not, I mean, can you speak about that for a second? Because I think there, I get a lot of nurses and teachers or ex-military women wanting to learn a business from home and recruiting or career coaching is so perfect. What, you know, what was your background? Because it was very different and made you think you could do this. Right. So I did. I was a nurse. Um, I'm a licensed nurse still. Um, I stopped working as a nurse. But um, I, you know, I'll always have that knowledge, you know. I didn't want to work as a nurse anymore. Um, had I ever done HR recruiting? No, never. But I was interested in it. So that's why I jumped in and um, I didn't go to school for it. I went to Diane for it. So. <laughs> well, great. It was much cheaper than college, right? Much cheaper than college. Absolutely. <laughs> it's Absolutely. an investment in yourself and in me. So thank you. Because there's a trust factor when you work with a mentor. Um, and yeah, here you started January of this year. And here we are a year later. You're still going strong. And you've um, when I did my program, I thought it would only be 90 day. But because of you and the students, it kind of came along too. It kind of continued because the advice often never ends, right? And um, and even into, you know, I taught you how to be a recruiter, but then that did evolve into my other passion, which teaching recruiters, not your career, how to become a career coach. Can you speak about how that developed and, um, you know, if, same thing, money you can make in that and how you've enjoyed that or what maybe other women might find interesting about not just recruiting from home, but becoming a career coach from home? Absolutely, yeah. So it's actually very... Um, it's a great pathway. Mm -hmm. um, it, 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 you really have an edge being a recruiter yep. to, because for, for a few things, even if you don't start off as a recruiter, career coaching is great. It is great, you know, coaching, um, you, you know, helping people get a better job, get a, you know, a new job, whatever it is. Um, but as a recruiter, being that, you know, I'm, I'm recruiting for certain jobs, when people come in, uh, say apply to the job or that I'm talking to on LinkedIn, if the position is not a right fit for them, then I can I can make an offer to help them with, you know, finding another position. 
you know, and that way it's an easy slide into, you know, becoming a, a, a career coachee, yep. you know, because they want a job, this job, they didn't want for whatever reason, or they didn't qualify for whatever reason, but they still need that job. Right. So it's like, I can help you with your resume. I can help you with your video resume. I can help you with the search. I can help you with marketing, you know, and you have the Kaplan name to, to back it up. Mm -hmm. So it, it, it's really a nice, a, a nice supplement or even do it full time. If you want to do it full time, it's really rewarding. You know, they're very appreciative. Yeah. You know, the client that, um, you know, I started with and he, he, he's just absolutely wonderful. And it's just very, very fulfilling. Yeah. And yet another client, you found him on your own, right? So you learned curriculum. You didn't really learn career coaching. I'm like, Lila, you did recruiting so fast. You all did this career coaching. You brought him in as a client before you even really learned the career coaching. So we kind of, you learned upon him. So I thought that was amazing. It's a great way, I think, for women to learn, you know, because it's in real time. I think that's one thing I love about the program. It's not like you're learning like in college where it's all book stuff and you got in the real world. With us, we're, you're thrown in real world, right? You're learning it on the clients. And like you said, they're so appreciative for that help, especially in the career coaching side right <laughs> absolutely yeah absolutely. it's a little it's a little tougher I must say with the corporate clients yeah um it's more money so yep. there's that pro and con thing the career coaching clients are more appreciative mm -hmm. but like like you said Diane um I just you know jumped in the water cold and I had I had you to, to help me along the way pretty much you're learning as you're going yep so exactly um, yeah. At least the blueprint is there, right? And, and you're right. There's corporate, there's two clients, the corporate client, if you're a recruiter, then the candidate client, more personal, if you're a coach. And, you know, so the one's probably minimum 10K, or if you're starting maybe 6K, like, well, I didn't make growing it to 10 or 11K. On the coaching side, I might start lower at a few K and then grow up to 6K or more from there. Um, but having two streams of income, the reason I like teaching both is giving women more options and streams of income under that same umbrella, your own business. I mean, you did do this under, even though you used Kaplan as a certified coach, like you became through me, but you started your own business immediately as well, right? You're a 1099 independent woman with your own staffing business now and then career coaching on the side. So how has that kind of changed your life from when you first met me? Oh, a hundred percent has changed, you know, total 360. Um, yeah, I started, you know, I, you know, just threw myself in this and I trusted, I trusted you, Diane. And, um, you know, you really, you know, helped me every single step of the way. Um, I didn't know a thing about this. I don't have an HR background. I don't have a recruiting background. So it's nursing and some, and some sales, you know, that's it. And um, even, even, you don't even need that. You don't even need the sales. You know, Diane will teach you everything. And another thing, like everything you need is in the course. Like even like um um to when you're starting off, like you mentioned imposter syndrome, Diane. Yep. You might have a little imposter syndrome being like, I never had a business before. You know, um, Diane helped helped me, you know, guided me on how to set up an LLC. And then she gave me like templates of the contracts that she used. So um so, and then I kind of like use that and I was able to present myself to owners of corporations as a corporation myself to have that confidence, to have a legal binding contract, you know, and um, so that really helps with the imposter syndrome because, hey, you are a real business. You have a real contract made by Diane's lawyers, just adapt it to you to, right, right. to get that. So <laughs> now you have it and you're real. 